And now we are doing the Ho Oponopono chant to address issues of self worth. So, there was once a farmer, he had a little son called Gopal. And this farmer had two water pots, and every morning he used to go to the well. He had to walk a certain distance and he had to follow a certain path and what he'd do is he'd carry a bamboo pole on his shoulder and he'd hang both the pots you know on either side there'd be a pot and uh, this farmer would go to the well and he'd fill water and come back now one of these pots had a crack running and so that other pot which was fine often made fun of this other pot and that pot used to tell this pot which was cracked oh you are useless you are no good I don't even know why the farmer keeps you you aren't able to retain water at all what's the good of having a pot which cannot even retain water the farmer must be mad to keep you and the and that pot would, you know, silently shed tears, feel very unhappy <coughs> and so things continued. One day, this farmer's little son, Gopal, he said to his father, today I too want to go with you. When you go to the well, I too want to come with you. And the father said, yes, come along. And they went down that path and they reached the well and the farmer filled both the water pots with water and he hung them on either side and he started walking back. And the little boy hopped and skipped along and he noticed that one of the pots because of that crack which was running on it, water was dripping from there. And he told his father, look at this. this, this pot has a crack on it. And it's, you know, dripping water, why have you kept this pot? Why did you fill it with water? What is the good of this pot? And that other pot was feeling mighty proud, you know, because that little boy had voiced exactly his sentiment. And so now the farmer said to little Gopal, let me show you something. And he showed Gopal, look to the side of the road and see what lovely flowers are growing a line of plants with lovely flowers can you see that and little gopal said yes they are so lovely such lovely flowers and the father said i knew that this pot had a crack and so i i just planted some seeds and I took care to hang this pot on this side so that as I would walk back home, water from this pot would go down and those seeds would be watered and see what lovely plants and what lovely flowers. And so little Gopal understood that even though it appeared that the pot was flawed, even in that flawed state it had a purpose. Often in life, we, we feel flawed in some way. Or when we look at our children and we make some unfavorable comparisons, look at your uncle's son, look at your aunt's daughter, whatever we might be doing. Or look at that child in class, why can't you be more like him or her, whatever 
and we start observing some flaws in our children. Observing flaws is not our role. That is not our role. Why are we parents? Why are we teachers? Why are we anything mature or adult or wherever we are? Our role is to think how can we allow this person to be more productive wherever he or she is, in whatever state he or she is. How can I get this person to be more productive? That is our role. And so today's chant is, we are going to directly address the inner child to heal self-worth issues. <clears throat> Dear inner child, I am sorry for buying into the illusion that you are not good enough. Please forgive me for thinking you are unlovable, unworthy and undeserving. I love you for being a part of me. Thank you for being with me. Please repeat, I am sorry. Please forgive me. I love you. Thank you. Dear inner child, I am sorry for taking you so far away from your truth. Please forgive me for making you believe you needed other people to love you and accept you. I love you unconditionally. Thank you for being a part of me. Please repeat, I am sorry. Please forgive me. I love you. Thank you. Dear inner child, I am sorry for creating a false mold for you. Please forgive me for forcing you to step into it. I love you for your essence. Thank you for giving me an opportunity to heal. Please repeat, I am sorry. Please forgive me. I love you. Thank you. Dear inner child, I am sorry for making you believe that you are of value only if other people value you. Please forgive me for this confused thinking. I love you and I am listening to you now. Thank you for keeping the light bright for me. Please repeat, I am sorry. Please forgive me. I love you. Thank you. Dear inner child, I am sorry for the belief that you derive your worth from others. Please forgive me for letting you feel small. I love you and I will always cherish you. Thank you for showing me how to be happy. Please repeat, I am sorry. Please forgive me. I love you. Thank you. Dear inner child, I am sorry for making you believe that you need love and approval from others. Please forgive me for forgetting that you need everything only from me. I love you and will nurture your dreams. Thank you for being resilient and strong. Please repeat, I am sorry. Please forgive me. I love you. Thank you. Dear inner child, I am sorry I forgot that when I love and approve of you, others will have to do it too. Please forgive me for not guiding you correctly. I love you little one just the way you are. Thank you for helping me see the world through your innocent eyes. Please repeat, I am sorry. Please forgive me. I love you. Thank you. Dear inner child, I am sorry for teaching you that if others don't love you, you are unlovable. Please forgive me for this misguided thinking. I love you and will always cherish you. Thank you for holding on to joy and hope. Please repeat, I am sorry. Please forgive me. I love you. Thank you. I am sorry, my inner child, for allowing you to feel that unless you contribute to the family finances, you are not worthy. Please forgive me for the difficult choices you have had to make. I love you and I promise to value you. 
Thank you for being so innocent and forgiving. Please repeat, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. I love you. Thank you. I'm sorry, my inner child, for making you doubt your inherent worth. Please forgive me for not recognizing your unique gifts. I love you deeply and unconditionally. Thank you for your spontaneity. Please repeat, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. I love you. Thank you. I'm sorry, my inner child, for doubting your capabilities. Please forgive me for allowing others to put you down for no reason. I love you for who you are. Thank you for just being you. Please repeat, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. I love you. Thank you. I'm sorry, my inner child, for not believing in your potential. Please forgive me for not being your cheerleader. I love you for your pure heart and spirit. Thank you for being so loving and kind. Please repeat, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. I love you. Thank you. I'm sorry, my inner child, for allowing opinions of others to define you. Please forgive me for not giving you the validation you needed from me. I love you for your innocent ways. Thank you for being so innocent. Please repeat, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. I love you. Thank you. I'm sorry, my inner child, for being overly critical of you. Please forgive me for not embracing your imperfections. I love you for your loving spirit. Thank you for being so patient. Please repeat, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. I love you. Thank you. I'm sorry, my inner child, for letting them take your share of the credit. Please forgive me for allowing them to steal your light. I love you and accept every part of you. Thank you for having such a loving heart. Please repeat, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. I love you. Thank you. I'm sorry, my inner child, for making you believe that you did not deserve happiness. Please forgive me for not taking pride in who you are. I love you and your vulnerability. Thank you for being my source of joy. Please repeat, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. I love you. Thank you. I'm sorry, my inner child, for making you hold on to self-limiting beliefs. Please forgive me for not seeing your true value and worth. I love you and shall listen to you. Thank you for your forgiving heart. Please repeat, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. I love you. Thank you. And now we'll do the I forgive myself statements. I forgive myself, my inner child, for seeking approval from others. Please repeat, I forgive myself, my inner child. I forgive myself, my inner child, for staying in toxic situations. Please repeat, I forgive myself, my inner child. I forgive myself, my inner child, for guilt, shame and anger. Please repeat, I forgive myself, my inner child. I forgive myself, my inner child, for feelings of worthlessness. Please repeat, I forgive myself, my inner child. I forgive myself, my inner child, for carrying emotional burdens for too long. Please repeat, I forgive myself, my inner child. I forgive myself, my inner child, for not understanding your pain. Please repeat, I forgive myself, my inner child. I forgive myself, my inner child, for feelings of inadequacy. Please repeat, I forgive myself, my inner child. I forgive myself, my inner child, for perfectionism. Please repeat, I forgive myself, my inner child. I forgive myself, my inner child, for being afraid to acknowledge you. Please repeat, I forgive myself, my inner child. 
I forgive myself my inner child for self-criticism. Please repeat, I forgive myself my inner child. I forgive myself my inner child for making unfavorable comparisons. Please repeat, I forgive myself my inner child. I forgive myself my inner child for defining your future by your past. Please repeat, I forgive myself my inner child. I forgive myself, I forgive myself. I completely and absolutely forgive myself. Please repeat, I am sorry. Please forgive me. I love you. Thank you.